वर्षा वॉट इज द टाइम नाउ वर्षा वॉट इज द टेम्परेचर नाउ temperature in waterford is 7 degrees celsius hello guys so this is a follow up video to the previous video that i made on uh, the getting started with the aiy project kit so many of them have received the aiy project kit many of them are still on the waiting list and some have already started implementing the uh, google home stk or the google assistant stk on their raspberry pi so this video is about uh, creating a wake word to interact with your raspberry pi or your uh, google assistant on raspberry pi so you need not uh, press any enter key or you need not press any buttons or uh, switches so you can use this wake word and then start interacting with your uh, google assistant on raspberry pi so for this build we'll be making use of the snowboy hot word so it is very easy so this you can get it up and running in about uh, 5 minutes or 10 minutes maximum so log into the uh, snowboy account you can use either your facebook github or uh, google account so this is the hotword library so if you are uh, signing into it for the first time you need to create a hotword which you want to use with the raspberry pi as the wake word so create hotword give your hot word a name and then uh, choose the appropriate language so don't uh, give a french name and choose an english language and give a english name or choose a french language choose it appropriately and then uh, choose record my voice so click record call out your wake word once do it the second time third time and after this your model will be ready for download so once your model is ready for download uh, your custom model will appear here with a gear icon a play symbol and a cloud symbol so i have created my custom wake word called varsha so you can create a uh, any custom so after this uh, click on the cloud icon over here your uh, wake word will get downloaded and after that uh, click on the documents option over here at the left top so there are some dependencies uh, which you need to install for getting this uh, snowboy up and running so all these are given over here and first and foremost you need something called the decoder so we are running the google assistant on a raspberry pi so download the raspberry pi uh, decoder and then just scroll down and these are the various dependencies which you need to install for the snowboy to work So open the terminal copy and paste these command one by one so most of these commands uh, will be pre installed with your uh, google assistant so as you can see most of them are uh, pre installed okay so there is one more last uh, dependency which is not given here it is called the atlas so i will leave the that command alone in the description of this video so after that is done minimize this minimize your terminal and head over to the downloads folder so with the downloads folder uh, click on the decoder that you just uh, downloaded right click and choose extract to and over here remove the downloads and it should be just home/py and then choose extract and after this uh, right click on your voice model and choose cut 
and now move into the uh, decoder directory and paste your voice model over here and there are some changes we need to make over here open the light.py in text editor and change the high to low over here and then the time dot uh, sleep will be 0 0.5 and the blink will be 0 0.05 close save and then uh, go into the voice recognizer go into the config open the voice recognizer dot ini just make sure that you have the uh, trigger equal to clap commented so your uh, clap should not be a trigger close that go back again and now go into src and then main.py open it in text editor just scroll down until you reach a line called gpio trigger channel equal to 23 change this 23 to 17 close save and then go into the py directory right click and choose show hidden files and then now go into dot config and then open the voice recognizer dot ini and again here you should have your uh, trigger equal to clap commented or disabled close after this again head back to your decoder directory copy this path open your terminal and type cd paste the path and then press enter type sudo nano trigger dot py So now head back to your browser and over here just keep scrolling down until you reach this uh, LED symbol and below that you will have a big line of code. Copy this line of code which says bling an LED. Uh, with the snow boy copy this copy this and paste it over here and then press ctrl x to save and then y and then enter to exit So that is pretty much it guys so now uh, once you restart you should have everything ready and everything in place to get started with your wake word so now once you restart your pi uh, you can start using your uh, wake word so let me just restart my pi once so after restarting open the terminal and move into the uh, decoder directory and then run the following command it will be sudo python space uh, the trigger file that you created followed by your voice model so once you press that you will get a uh, notification called server failed on something like that just do not mind that okay okay so now if you see the button does not work so no, the trigger is just by voice. Varsha, what is the time now? The time is 3.13 a.m. Varsha, what is the temperature now? In Waterford, it's currently 4 degrees Celsius. 
Varsha, who are you? I'm your Google Assistant. How can I help you? Varsha, tell me a joke. One joke coming up. What do you get when you put a vest on an alligator? An investigator. Okay, so that is pretty much it, guys. So that is how you can use uh, the wake word to interact with your uh, Google Home Assistant. Say, be it the AIY project kit or uh, your own uh, build of your Google Assistant. So I hope you find this useful and informative. Thank you.